the final of the women's single skulls underway here at the World Championship St. Catharines 1999. Lane 1 New Zealand, 2 Canada, 3 Russia, 4 Germany, 5 Bulgaria and 6 closest to the camera, the reigning Olympic champion from Belarus, Miss Carson. In lane number 6 there, Ekaterina Carson, she's blasted out in the final just like she did in the heat. Quickest 500 metres in the heat, quickest 500 metres in the semi, and she's leading the race now. A fantastic first 150 metres by the reigning Olympic champion, the world champion in 1997. A little bit of tailwind here this morning on the first day of the uh, finals, and that's assisting these scholars. The crews now move out towards 250 metres. Custom from Belarusia, formerly Ekaterina Kodotovic, Olympic champion in 1996. She won the races from the front, but here we see the reigning world champion Fedotova. In my view, the best sculler in this race, but somehow her form's dipped since Lucerne Regatta, where she finished in third place. Major showdown here in this final between this woman here the Olympic champion, sculling loosely relaxed. She's into a rhythm now, down onto uh, race rate, and looking very comfortable. And the white boat there, the German Katrin Rutschau, she had a poor start, but she's pulling back. 500 metres gone, the women, single skull, final. A fantastic first 500 by this woman here, the reigning Olympic champion, world champion, in the uh, 1997, those captions are wrong there, it's the Belarusian girl in lane 6 who leads from in lane number 3, Russia, the world champion. And we can just see the shot there of Karsten's face, she never ever looks around, never looks around, she's totally focused towards the stern of the boat, took time out to have a baby. 1998, she's come back to the sport. She used to win from the front, but she just didn't quite seem to have the pace to do it in the same way as the field moved back to her. Crews now moving through 750 metres. Katrin Rutschau, she won a semi-final. Stunning performance, didn't expect to see her in front at this stage and she's moving through very very well as they come up to 1000 meters. But Nikola there in red and green from Bulgaria, we can expect to see her in contention as they move through a thousand. The look back there at Marlene B, the local girl, Olympic champion 96 and at 1992, a little bit off the pace here this morning race at the moment between these uh, top girls. The Olympic champion, we're looking there at the Olympic champion in quadruple skulls as the single scholars now go through and approach the 1,000 meter mark. 1,000 gone, women's single skull final. The Olympic champion lane number six from Belarus, Carson leads by a couple of feet over Rothschild and Felatova. Again, those captions are slightly suspect. But this woman here, no doubt about that, she is winning, assisted by the tailwind conditions. And I think the Bulgarian sculling here in lane five, we can just see the bow of her boat, Nikova is very handily placed to make a move. If it goes anything like the semi-final, then she should be strong in this third 500. But Rutschau, 24 years of age, a product of the former East German system, a coach Dieter Ohm comes from Potsdam, and all the scholars in Germany tend to be based in the east of that country. Twice world junior champion. The champion there closest to the camera pushed on now in this third 500 meters. Opened up again another three quarters of a length. Boat lead it was down to a couple of feet at the thousand meters. She responded to the right. She got a little look to the right and responded to the midway pushes from the rest of the scholars. Moving on three quarters of a length up.
Look at the focus in that face. In the semi-final, she had nine seconds fade between the first and second 500. We haven't seen anything of that today. She's absolutely focused like she was at Lucerne, where she took the title. We expected this woman, late five, recover from Bulgaria, to be more competitive. But Carsten is re-establishing herself. A look across there, just a tiny glance from those eyes across to Nakova. And it's going to take a big finish from any of these women to get through her. meters remain in the women's single skull final the Olympic champion Ekaterina Carson from Belarus has opened up clear water over Bulgaria over the uh, Germany Rothschild Katerina Rothschild second herself at this world at the world championships in 1998 and Carsten sculling at 35 strokes a minute and that's a very handy lead to have almost the length of clear water as we look back down the field and these scholars don't really have the sort of sprint finish unless Carsten loses it in the last 250 metres. It looks like she's going to win the first final of the day here. So now as Katerina Carsten from Belarus, the Olympic champion 1996, the world champion in 1997, starts to increase her rate, starts to build for the final line. Some 300 metres remain. And here comes the challenge now from Nikova, the Bulgarian scholar, and also from Rothschild, Germany. Katerina Rothschild in lane number four, the silver medalist last year. Those legs just driving the boat through the water of Ekaterina Carsten. Fantastic race, she's really laid the gauntlet down and now she's going to hang on to the finish and not look out. But Wichau here in the white boat from Germany maybe has the finish to get back on level terms if Carsten loses it. 150 metres remain, the women's single star final. These girls racing for the World Championship gold medal. The Olympic champion back on four, clear water from the rest of the field. 50 metres remain now, the race is on for second place. Rothschild and Nekova and the world champion from Russia, Fedotova. This is where the gold medal is going to this woman. Coming up to the line, 37 strokes per minute over the line. Silver medal, Rothschild, and it will be on the line between Nekova and Fedotova for that bronze medal. And I think we'll wait for the uh, confirmation that bronze may well have gone to Nekova from Bulgaria. No doubt though, Martin, the winner here. So, confirmation there. The result, Belarus, Germany, Bulgaria.